Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a really good day. If you are new to my channel, my name is Sebastian and I welcome you guys with open arms. I have not had almost any water today, bitch. I did not stick to my diet and I'm bloated as a motherfucker. But let me tell you guys something. You know what? There's always going to be tomorrow, right? There's always going to be motherfucking tomorrow. And for that, we have to just lay and say to ourselves, Sebastian or yourselves, Kathy, Mary... Elizabeth, Tom, bitch, I don't know. It's okay. Today wasn't your day, but tomorrow will be. Or in half an hour, it will be. So don't be so hard on yourself, bitch. And yes, that was my intro. That was my intro because I felt it important to tell you to fucking love yourself, bitch. Or try. Um, you are new to my channel. My name is Sebastian. I do tea videos every single day. And I'm so grateful to be here with you. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and help me get to 18K. I would be so, so grateful. Okay, you guys. So... I did a, so yesterday, aka today, because I'm recording this a day before, so you have this early in the morning, because I know you guys love to watch and, 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 and be with me while you have coffee on your way to work, in your shower, on the toilet. Bitch, I don't know where I am right now with you, but I'm grateful to be here, okay? Drink some water! Um, so, Gabby Hanna, of course, posted a video today, and she... You know, it was an hour long. I did the, I did the, um, the whatchamacallit. I did the whole, like, um, what is that word I'm looking for? Like, I broke it down for you guys in one video. Um, but I was told it was a little bit long. So I wanted to do a shorter version and add some new things that just came to my my mind, or not my mind, my attention span, okay? So listen, you guys, um, in this video, right? So basically, you guys, if you don't know, Gabby Hanna basically said that Jesse Smiles was obsessed with her, that they had a very, very short-lived friendship, and that Gab that Jesse has done so many videos on Gabby, and that Gabby's only done that one video, she said. Um, she said that, you know, she loves the word obsession, that She's obsessed, Trish is obsessed, everybody's obsessed with her. She is, and she calls herself the common denominator to everyone. Um, she, in this video, right, this hour-long video, in not one moment does she take any, not one time does she take any accountability. I mean, I didn't see it, bitch. I did not see her say, you know what? I was wrong. And let me remind you, let me motherfucking remind you that it takes two to motherfucking tango, okay? Oh, literally, two to tango. It cannot all be Jesse's fault. It cannot all be, um, you know, Trisha's fault. It cannot all be everyone else's fault. And I don't understand. And, you know, Gabby has this, like, thing where she says that Jesse is the one who is fully obsessed with her. That Jesse is the one that does not let go. And that Jesse uses her for clout and for views. But what I'm saying, right, is that Gabby does the same, right? Gabby does the motherfucking same. And, you know, she says that Jesse waits until Gabby's in the news. That if, oh girl, what is that? Oh, I was, I was like, are the Avengers here, bitch? What is happening? Keep on dancing till the world ends, bitch. Um, you know, she's basically saying that like, every time Gabby is in the news or, or a YouTuber has an issue with her or anything, that Jesse, you know, fuck, like, you know, Jesse climbs on that and like, you know, she takes part of it so she, her name can be out there. Um, Jesse in her last video, she did say she will never speak about Gabby Hanna again. Now, I'm not sure because, you know, Gabby said the same, but now we have part one that came out today and now we're gonna have part two because she announced it at the end of the part one video. So this is not far from over, right? This is gonna continue and continue until Bitch, God knows when, right? God knows when is this is going to continue. Um, and uh, look, you know, she says like we literally had a couple months, like seven to eight month friendship. And this is now 2020, almost 2022. And that Jesse is still talking about this. Um, she says she does not keep up with Jesse, that she didn't even know Jesse was pregnant. And that's the thing, you guys, like, that's the thing that kind of like, wows me is that you know even after when jesse said in her video that this was her rainbow baby if you guys don't know what that is that's the baby that you you create after you 
you know, have a miscarriage. And even after Jessie said this in her video, I, I feel like at the end of the day, like, yes, a lot of things, you know, have happened. Um, Gabby, of course, in her world, thinks she is the victim, that she is the, you know, she is the one who's hurt and who deserves an apology. But what Jessie went through is so difficult. Not, not only the loss of a child, but everything that happened with Curtis, right? So Gabby taking this time off, she says to reflect and to edit and to take out some personal stories and all these things. It just goes to show that there is zero sympathy. And that is what hurts me because all this time, you know, on my channel, you guys, I like to always think the good in people. I like to give second chances. I like to think that, you know, that there's good in the world, right? Um, but after watch, like for example, let's just, for example, right? Let's say you hate someone. You hate someone and they've done horrible things to you, right? Let's, for example, say, let's pretend we're Gabby Hanna and that Jesse Smiles is ruining my life and Jesse Smiles is not stopping until I've taken everything away from me, um, you know, doing all of these things. If this was all that, right? And I get it. You feel this way. You you hate this girl, right? You you, my God. After knowing what Jesse has gone through and the loss of a child, you would think that somebody would say, "Look, I, I, I would say this, right? I would say, look, I don't like Jesse. I don't like her. I don't trust her." But I never wish, I will ever wish her ill will. And the loss of a child is something very much bigger than, than this, if I was Gabby, right? I would say, I wish her well, I wish her health for the baby, and I would move on. If I still had things to say, I would at least wait until she gave birth. You know what I mean? Like, I would at least wait until her and the baby are healthy. Like, if she really needed to say things, you know, and now it's 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 late in the pregnancy. Like, Ga like Jesse's probably, you know, um, just, yeah, Jesse's probably in like the last months, you know, before giving birth or very soon, and she has to now see this video. So, I get you want to tell your side, and I get you want to do this, but there are bigger things, I guess, to worry about than than this. You know what I mean? Clear your name, of course if that's what you feel you have to do and that you feel that you were wronged for. But I don't know if I think, you know, that I think this could have waited. Um, and there goes to show that, you know what? Gabby said it herself, she's a narcissist. And that she is, she admitted to saying, you know, that she's an alleged bully. So I don't know you guys, you know what I mean? There's, listen, you can only teach a bitch to contour, and if she doesn't learn, then she's just not gonna learn, right? I don't like that you can walk a horse to the river, but you can't make the horse drink the water, well, bitch, you can't teach a girl to contour until she doesn't learn, you know what I'm trying to say. I just, I don't know, at this point in time, this is very messy, and this is only part one, you guys. There's going to be a part two very soon, uh, Gabby said. She said, subscribe for part two, so there's going to be a part two. God knows what she's going to say on this. I'm just reading and seeing if there's any updates on Twitter. Um, you know, she says that Jesse will not stop until everything is taken away from Gabby. She blames Jen. She blames everyone around her. And I said this in my previous video, and I will say it again, okay? You are responsible for allowing things to happen in your life, period, okay? People can do things to you, of course, horrible things. And it takes a lot of strength to walk away and say, I will no longer allow you to hurt me. I will no longer allow you to drag my name in the dirt. I will stand up for myself. Standing up for yourself, not allowing people to drag your name and not allowing people to hurt you is very different than, according to you, going down their level, right? So. What what are you what are you accomplishing then? Like that's what I don't understand. So, anyways, you guys, um, I wanted to make this 
kind of short because, you know, a couple of you said my videos are getting too long, but I mean, I don't really do long videos, but okay, girl. Um, but anyways, so this was just like a quick little recap. Um, but there is, a there is another video that I'm just like so annoyed to do, but a couple of you are requesting it. So you will get it a little bit later. I also have two, uh, videos coming out later today that I recorded so today's supposed to be Thursday, right, bitch? Today's Thursday. So I recorded this on Wednesday. I recorded uh, two other videos on Wednesday. One video not knowing that Gabby was ever going to talk. I actually... Bitch, I am that so raven, okay? I am that so raven because I predicted she was going to talk. So you'll see that video. It's pre-recorded. And you're going to see another video and then another video. So you're probably going to get like four or five videos today. So you guys said, please upload frequently. And bitch... I'm uploading frequently. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful day. And if you don't feel your best, trust me, it is okay to have an off day. And it's okay to have an off week, month, year. Okay? As long as we don't give up and we slowly, little by little try, we're going to be okay. I love you guys so much. Bye.